So you're not tired yet? You're not tired of, uh, of being a heavy, carrying all the burden, carrying all the weight on your shoulders. Who you riding with? Who's riding for you? That's the question. So you give and give and give. And oh yeah, they have no problem, absolutely no problem, taking and taking and taking. And you share your come up goals. You share your great ideas. You share your strategies. You share your victories. And on the outside, they're smiling. And they're telling you, hey, great job. Hey, I'm proud of you. Hey, I'm excited for you. But on the other side, they're talking behind your back. They jealous. They salty. Have a line that I wrote one of my rap songs where I say, they pour more salt than trucks and snow. I say thinking they words offend me. But to you, they words do offend you because they hurt you and they cut you like a knife. But somehow in your mind, you feel like you could never be without them. Those are my friends. They got my back. No, they don't have your back. I need you to stop acting like a doggone ostrich and get your head out of the sand and stand up on your own too, tall on your 10 toes and realize you can do bad by yourself because the fact of the matter is they don't want to see you win. And it's impossible to win when you have bad teammates. And I said this earlier, fake friends, bad friends are like bad cavities and they must be removed. I love this quote. It says, fake friends are no different than shadows. They stick around during your brightest moments but disappear during your darkest hours. And that's exactly what's happening to you when you're winning, when you're getting fitted for the ring, when you're hoisting the banners, when you're raising the trophy, when you're taking them out to eat, when you're giving them a loan, when you're giving them a ride, when you're listening to them, when they talking your ear off about their problems, they're all up in your grill, all up in your face. But you remember that time when you needed somebody to talk to. Remember that time you was a little short on your rent. You remember that time when this happened or that happened and you tried to call them. Couldn't get in touch with them. Nowhere to be fine. So they riding for you when you up. But they all up out of that car when you're down. Here's the thing. You need to find you a circle of friends. Find you a circle of people that not only you trust, but when you win, they feel truly that they won. And when they win, you feel truly that you won. Sometimes you gotta go it alone. Sometimes you gotta be okay being by yourself until you found the right one, until you find the right group. Sometimes it may only be one, one genuine, one true, one ride or die. It's better to have one friend who understands your tears and a whole bunch of people that only know your smile. They don't know you in here. They don't know what makes you tick. They don't know what makes you smile. They don't know what gets you going. They don't know how to pick you up when you fall. And that's why sometimes you have to pick yourself up. And that's perfectly okay. Just make sure those in your circle are riding for you. Make sure those in your circle truly want to see you win because remember you can do bad all by yourself and if they stabbing you in the back you don't need them y'all know i call them halftime homies half the time they smile in your face half the time they want to take your place ice cube said used to be my homie now you act like you don't know me remove them bad cavities today i'm your dentist and i'm telling you to get them out of your mouth get them out of your circle get them out of your life because ultimately you're trying to win and if they don't want to see you win, it's impossible. But I need you to keep riding, I need you to keep grinding, I need you to keep rolling, and I need you to keep winning. Because that's what we're trying to do. Climb the hump. Eliminate those fake friends. And make each and every day of your life a Wednesday. This is a great day to win. Let's go.